what is going on, y'all? It is your boy. You know who it is. I'm thinking since we only got three hours till comp time, man. I'm gonna just gonna hop on, kick it with y'all, and have a good ass time, man. How are you guys doing today, man? Three hours till comp time, man. I'm stoked. My first race as a solo driver, man. I'm super excited. Like, I honestly can't wait. Three hours away, man. That's it. Yeah, boy, yeah, man. And if y'all didn't catch the qualifying rounds earlier, uh, I did my qualifying run. Out of 150 drivers, I placed in the top six. I placed sixth, which was like the top ten. So that was super dope. But, yo, race time is three hours away, man. I can't fucking wait. <laughs> I don't know, Ryu. That's a definite. That's a hard to say question because there's a lot of really good drivers out on the track. I'm not gonna lie. There's a lot of good drivers that are gonna be running. So it'll be interesting to see where. Ooh, ooh. So it'll definitely be interesting to see where. It goes, you know, I'm definitely, you know, going to try my best to obviously win. But also at the same time, I'm not expecting to. Because, you know, it's my first race of the season as a solo driver. Uh, like I said, I'll be going up against some really good talent that's out there for esports. So I'm definitely stoked to have the... GoPro camo set up for comp time. I've got uh, my mic all set and ready to go. I've got pretty much anything I would really need to get it going set up and ready to rumble. Dude, I don't need a... Dude, this is a fucking gaming ring. The only thing I need is my fucking racing harness right here. This is all I fucking need. I don't need a fucking one. I'm not actually racing an old. Now, if I was in a legit race car, then yeah. But until I get like a motion rig, like the motion rig that makes you, you know, feel like you're actually there and it moves you around with everything, the only thing I really need is this. Now, when it comes down to the motion rig, then yeah, I'm obviously going to need, you know, that extra bit of safety. Now, if you guys don't know, I did. Redo the harness. I did that with it. I took, ran through the middle piece or through the metal slots. And then, you know, obviously, you know, boom. You know, you just throw it over your, you just throw it over your head like that. And attach it to your body down here, and you're good to go. So, you know, it's literally just like a regular. Um, if you guys have ever looked like at like a rally car, um, that's what they'll do is they'll have the roll cage bar, the like the roll cage bar back behind the seat, and uh, the racing harness will be attached to that. Very similar thing with this. I have this little bar that goes across the back right here that the harness is attached to, and then it just goes up and over the seat. Just like your regular, you know, racing harness for 
rally cross racing. And it does too. It actually does keep me from sliding around in the chair. Because I noticed, like, I watched back at a lot of my older live streams where I had both the wheel cam and regular cam. I noticed I was constantly doing this and, you know, sliding around. And this kind of keeps me, you know, when I do move around, my whole body moves with it. So that I'm not like this over here. I'm still, you know, dead center. I can have total control over the wheel because I can boom, boom, move my hand and adjust my hands as needed on the wheel as my body is, you know, turning and shifting because this chair does like to spin a lot. So. There is that. But, yo, guys, I do have to bounce for now. I do still have to get ready. I still have to do a promo for the race. Um, I do need to do one last final qualifying run. Um, I was actually supposed to do my final qualifying run literally like about an hour ago, but I do need to do the last one just to see where I place that, see where I'm standing officially. And yeah, I just wanted to come in for a few minutes to let you guys know. Two more hours. Yeah, well, three hours left. So be ready, man. Three hours. It's go time, boys. And I will see you guys on the track in three hours, man. Peace.